Welcome to another edition to the Assassin's Sports Show and much more. Guys, thank you for the love, support, the energy you bring each and every day, guys. Thank you for the um, criticism. Thank you for the comments below, guys. Thank you so much. I am really blessed. We are growing the show. We just added one more new subscriber, guys. Now we are at 238. We just growing the show little by little, guys. So thank you, thank you. This is a new generation of YouTube. This is all about the fans, guys. All about the fans, man. So... Anything you want me to bring bring up to the table, let me know and I'll bring it, guys. So it's all about y'all, y'all. The face to run the place. All my assassins, welcome, man. My original assassins, that we built this thing from the bottom up. Thank you for sticking with me, guys. And all my new assassins, thank you for supporting the show. Thank you for watching the videos. Taking your time to watch my videos. This is a new generation of YouTube. And when I say that, you know why I say it. Because nobody in YouTube is doing this for the fans. They got their own stick and that's it. It's over with. And not this show. This show is all about y'all, guys. It's all about y'all. 24-7. It's all about y'all. So this show is about the fans. I want to hear your opinions. Your And your opinions are beautiful because it comes from you. It always comes from you. It comes from your heart. So it's a beautiful thing when you have different views. And that's what I want in this show. We might agree to disagree, but that's a beautiful thing, guys. So, let's get on with the show, guys. If you like the channel, hit that subscribe button and become an assassin. Just like that symbol, right? So, let's get on with the show now. Um, We got breaking news, guys. The Dolphins traded away Kevin Berlage to the Jets. Now, I'm loving this trade because Berlage, I never liked him when he came out. I, I, didn't, I didn't think he was a great tailback. Um, he was awful last year. I mean, he was awful. And then for the Jets to trade a late drop, a late round draft pick, it's a freaking amazing that Chris Freer is doing an amazing, amazing job. First, you trade away uh, Harris for something. They, that guy cannot play. I don't care who you are. You got something for him that... I didn't think that was going to be possible. Now, you trade away Kevin uh, Kevin Bellage, and you got Sunday for him, and then you traded to the Jets, and then Anna Gates traded for him? What? I mean, that's hard. That's horrible. That's, like, Anna Gates saw him up and close and personal, and you still traded for this dude? This dude is just horrible. He He's scared to get even hit. He don't like getting hit. And... He, I mean, you traded your draft pick, a draft pick form. I mean, wow. Wow. I don't know what kind of draft. It's a late draft pick, so it has to be like a six, seven round draft pick. It's not a big deal, but you still got something for him because if you got a six or seven, you could trade that seven to a six rounder, or if you got six, you could go move up to a, a fifth round draft pick. So it's amazing. And, and, and what I love, we just keep on piling it up, man, with draft picks. That's going to be crazy. And then for Anna Gates to trade, listen, we was going to release Kevin Bellage. And that's why I didn't post anything because I knew the rumors were coming strong. And that's why I posted it because I know a lot of teams wanted Kevin Bellage. And then for the for Anna Gates to trade him, that he's not a great, great tailback for you to trade him. And you could get that same tailback off the street. Let's be real. So, and then Chris Real just picking up more draft picks. That's that's amazing. This front office gets it. Now, like I said, I didn't agree with the Curtis Weaver um, um, release. I didn't agree with that. But listen, I'm not. Ne I'm never gonna agree with everything with what the Dolphins do. But in this instance, I agree with them 110 percent, man. And now um, it's just amazing to me. It's amazing to me that. Chris Greer is getting draft picks from players that don't even deserve draft picks, guys. And he's getting them. So that's the difference about this front office. He He's guessing. He's just piling it up, baby. So you're going to have a young team. And hopefully Tua could start uh, uh, start in week three, week four, week five. I don't know when he's going to start, but maybe he starts that kind of week. Whenever whenever he gets the ball, it's it's over. It's a wrap. That's it's his team. I want week one. Some fans want week um six, nine. So I don't know when he's I think two is is ready to take the the keys, man. That's why I believe he's ready to take that offense. But 
again, is what the coaches sees. If it like to me, if it's close with Tua and and Fitzpatrick, Tua should get the keys because he if he's healthy, let him rip, man, let him rip, baby, let him go. So again, that's my opinion. See what up. So yeah, we have Dolphin breaking news. So Kevin Bullock goes to the Jets. Listen, I don't think he, he he might not even make the team because the Jets got uh, a stack of running backs. So that's too much. Or the Jets have something in work to trade away Bell. I don't know. But that's re that's a head scratcher for the Jets to get. For whatever reason, the Jets always get our garbage. I don't get our coaches. Then they get, <laughs> they get our players that they ain't that good. And, and the Jets always get our garbage. That, listen, I ain't not, not a Jet fan, I'm a Dolph fan, but I'm going to tell you this. Jets, you want to go somewhere? Stop getting our garbage. Second of all, I got to fire Adam Gates because he's a mess. He don't give a fuck about y'all. And, and Sorry about the language, but he don't give a F about y'all at all. He already said he's rich as fuck and fuck, fuck the fans. Basically, that's what he said, guys. And y'all still keep him around? And I, listen, I'm, like I said, I'm not a Jets fan. <laughs> any, any bad news? Yeah, I get, yeah, I get, but yeah, yeah, you're shooting yourself in the foot, Jets fans. And I'm listen. I want to hear from y'all. What y'all think? I'm not a Jets fan, but I'm telling you, it, it doesn't look good, guys. Guys, Jet fans, it doesn't look good. If y'all training for our crap, that's crazy, man. That's crazy. Now I will tell you one thing. Y'all did a good thing training um Adams, and y'all got a lot of picks. But can you turn that picks to um a, a good draft? A draft. Because and a game screwing your team up, man. And they had a horrible um, scrimmage, I heard. Horrible. The offense didn't even show up, guys. So, yes, and the game rubs people the wrong way, guys. So, again, that was the news today. So, we have breaking news. The Dolphins straight away came from And there you go. I, I'm telling you, I'm on it, guys. Um, It's crazy. It's so crazy. So, tell me what y'all think. Tell me what y'all uh, y'all yeah, think about the video? I'm trying not to bomb my head too much because um, I, uh, a comment came in said I was bombing my head way too much. But I'm Cuban. I'm I, I'm moving with my hands. I'm moving with my head. So that's why you see me always, you know, moving my head. But I'm going to try my best not to move them like crazy. But, you know, it takes time, guys. It takes time. So thank you for the criticism. Thank you for the comments. <laughs> Anything y'all don't like, it's good, cool for me, man. I got... Thick skin, man, baby. I got thick skin, so it's what it is. It's y'all show, so it's all about y'all, baby. I'm not going to get mad because y'all criticize me. It is what it is. And, and y'all right. Sometimes y'all are right. So I got to stop that. So thank you for the love, support, the energy you bring. Guys, if you passing by my YouTube channel, and you like what you see, it's easy, right? Hit that subscribe button. Become my assassin today. Let's, let's try tonight to get 240, right? Let's get 240. Let's see when we could get 240. So, guys, stay tuned. I'm making another video.